Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Game Prepping. The channel where I'll take a line to thrift stores, flea markets, pawn shops, anywhere really I can get my hands on some video games, usually for a good price. At the end, as always, I do a small recap to show you guys everything I got throughout the week. And I really recommend you guys watching the entire video because I did some get some pretty good stuff uh, this past two weeks. Uh, as you know, and I do apologize, I did not upload a video last Monday. And uh, I don't know if you guys can tell on my boys, but I'm feeling a little bit under the weather. I'm actually getting out now. I went to the uh, doctor and he said that I had a acute bronchitis and he gave me some good medicine. So I'm a lot better now. So here I am back with another video. So guys, that's going to be it for now. I'll see you at the end. Hey guys, I'm on my way to meet uh, someone at a Publix. Uh, he has a Nintendo 64 with a game, um, Zelda, The Legend of Zelda, Ocarina of Time. No controllers, no wires, nothing, just the console and the game. And it is the, um, the Grip N64, the Fantastic series. Uh, N64, or one of them, and um, also a Sega Genesis Model 3 with a bunch of games. So, I think like six or eight games. So, let's see how it goes. Yeah, um, this is the PSP. Also, here's the power, and it works and everything. It's kind of thin. But uh, yeah, it works and and it has a game in there, Local Roco, and I also have some PSP games in there. The thing is, this was orig this wasn't originally mine. Like it wasn't a friend. Uh, a friend gave it to me, and I oh. thought, oh, cool. But then, like for the Dreamcast, like a lot of the games that he had weren't like that great. So. I'm just trying to get rid of it because I don't have any more space for these things. But yeah, the PSP and uh, I have games for it too if you want. But yeah, that's... And the N64 is right there. The only game I have for it is the uh, Ocarina of Time. Mind if I film? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. No problem, fine. <laughs> What I do remember is that it does work. Okay. You just gotta have it powered up. Because I remember playing it. Um, and what did you say you wanted for the Dreamcast? For the Dreamcast, I believe it was. Let me see. I have the prices. So for the Genesis, it was $30 that I listed. Um, the N64, also $30. But I mean, I could give you lower for that because it's just a console. I think we agreed on $45, right? Yeah, for the... Dreamcast and... And the, the N64 together. And uh, the PSP, I'm selling for $50. And you wanted it on the Dreamcast's price? Yeah. Uh, 70, but I could lower it probably. How much would you be willing to do on everything? Uh, so did, how what would you say? What did you say for the Genesis 3 and the N64? 45. You want the games too? Like, all, yeah. yeah. Um, maybe 180 for everything. 180? Yeah. Oh, my friend, that's pretty penny. That was 45 for the uh, 
This two right here, right? Mm-hmm. I mean, it's negotiable. It doesn't... You can see what we... Because I'm more than anything looking to get rid of it. All this stuff. Take a hundred for everything. Right now. Cash money. 110. 110. Now I'm just fucking you. 100 is fine. Alright. Alright, man. Thank you. I'm totally just trying to get rid of all. Um, can I see that down, uh, Silent Hill down, down, downpour? It's, uh, I think, like, the fifth one in the front. It's all the way up, all the way to the front. More and more. Keep on going. No. That's one Silent Hill. Same thing, tiny heel, down, four, that one. Uh, we're still doing the same deal you gave me last time, man? Half off on the second game, we're good. What's that? Half off on the second game, we're good. Um, three for ten, you said last time. You said what? Three for ten dollars. Oh, we're talking about for the PS3. Yes. Yeah, that's fine. I know, I know I saw another one somewhere here. Maybe it's on the ones that just fell over. Let me see that, uh... Uh, that Castlevania, Lord of Shadow. Uh, a little more this way. The blue one, the uh, blue, that one. Can I see that heavenly sword? Uh, second on this row, other row, the other, the other one, that one. So, more towards you, second one towards you, that one. Thirteen. Huh? Thirteen. No, I'll be seventeen. I just can't give it for again. That was the thing. This is all in our. I'll take this for them. Maybe next time, because I'm on a, I'm on a budget. What's going on, people of YouTube? Uh, I'm on my way to uh, a Goodwill. Let's see what we're going to find there. Hopefully, it's something good. of controllers. This one's not working properly. This one's not um, first party. That's third party. This one seems okay. All of the buttons work. All of the triggers work. I like this one with the that joystick show, maybe. Uh, for the GameCube, broken. Not really wanted anyway. Uh, not really wanted anyway. Seems like it's fine, but I don't. Not really interested in picking it up. This one, on the other hand, seems okay. The cord seems fine. So, yep, four bucks. Why not? I don't see any games. No games. I'm 
crazy, but look at here. Oh my goodness. Seems like they put all the games in one box for some reason. Maybe they get rid they're getting rid of them. Guitar hero. Another guitar hero. brand new but the seal stripped I don't have this one you know the games here are a dollar so why not alright Hmm. Must be my lucky day. Must be my lucky day. I found Mario Kart Wii right there on that one. Wow, well, it goes here, and I'm picking this one up for a buck. Why not? Right? Wouldn't you pick it? Wouldn't you pick it up for a dollar? I would. <laughs> so I have what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven games. <sighs> seven games, a dollar piece. Not bad. All right, guys. gonna be it. No, 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 no. I'm gonna find another Mario in here. Nope. No Mario. Gone. Alright guys, just to recap. Little list. Pet Shop Friends, uh, Guitar Hero Metallica, Mario Kart Wii, Pets Horse Club, Jeopardy, Magic Oscar Carts, and RV Horse Adventures. Looks like that's it for this one. Alright guys, there you have it. That's the thrift store I'm going to right now. So. It's what we can find inside. Mm. Oh, you're not in it. Please. Thank you very much. I don't know if I'm right, but... I was about to get out of the store when I saw this. I'm like, oh, might as well check it out.
Je ne peux pas acheter par la Hey guys, you made it all the way to the end. Thank you very much, I appreciate it. And uh, like I promised, I'm gonna do a small recap to show you guys everything I got throughout these past two weeks. And uh, let's get started. First, I'm gonna start with this. It's uh, the N64 grape version from the Fantas Fantastic series. I didn't, didn't remember to pull out the game, but it did came with the game um, Ocarina of Time, the great cartridge. And it does work. The only thing that needs it's a real good cleaning. And the reset button doesn't work for some reason. I need to take it apart and see if I can fix that. It did not came with any um, power cord or uh, controllers or the AB cords, so it's not bad. Next, I'm gonna show you guys the Sega Genesis Model 3. This one did came with the control with one controller actually. This one right here. Um, and uh, all the cords, AB cords and uh, power adapter. So this one's nice. Right there. It also came with a bunch of games. So uh, let's go through that. The following there, I'll lower it, please. Strider. Championship Pro Am. Flashback. This one has a nugly sticker right there. Alright. Terminator 2. Judgment Day. Afterburner 2. Mortal Kombat 2. Alien 3. Predator 2. Sonic 3 okay. Alien Storm uh, Quad Challenge I don't know if I mentioned this one or not so, Strider This one is actually the worst of the bunch oh, That's alright I do not have it so I'm glad to add it to that collection so that I can play it Next is going to be uh, the Dreamcast. He has a uh, disc inside. It does work. House of the Dead 2. It's actually in pretty good condition. It's a bit scratched. It works just fine. This is the game I used to test it. It did came with a controller. A uh, empty case for uh, the DS. Nothing's in it. Uh, Super Mario 64. A case for uh, Mortal Kombat Gold with the back part. No disc. That was disappointing. Uh, Sega NHL 2K. Just the disc in the back. Sega Bass Fishing, disc only with the back, no manual. This one's complete. Fur Fighters, it's nice, it's nice condition. Um, Sonic Adventures, the case is cracked. That's all right. You can always do a swap. The game is also in pretty good condition. Uh, Code Veronica. This one I already did a case swap. Well, I don't know if you guys saw it on the video. It was all cracked. So it looks pretty nice now. Sonic Shuffle. Never played this game, but uh, I will now. This one's also in pretty good condition. And this one, the Sega Dreamcast 
web browser. Um, that's all the games that came with the Dreamcast. It also came with all the hookups, power adapter, the controller, and um, the AV cord. So, man. Yeah. Next, I'm gonna show you the uh, PSP. God of War edition. It is in pretty good condition. I mean, it has some scratching mostly here on the shiny part, a little ring, but uh, other than that, it's in amazing condition. Came with a uh, game inside, La Rocco. works perfectly. I also got all the PSP games that he had Midnight Club 3. I think there was just a disc in case. It's alright. Grand Theft Auto. Liberty City Stories. I think I have this one and I have the Midnight Club 3. Need to check. Metal Gear Solid. Portable Ops. This one going in that collection. I do not have it. I do not have it. And uh, Tekken. Dark Resurrection. Sorry, I forgot it came with another game in there. Tony Hawk. Underground 2. Remix. Disc and case only. Uh, no manual, but that's alright. I'm not a this, so it's alright. Besides, when my collection, maybe sooner or later, I'll find the I'll find the manual. So next is gonna be another thrift store find, and most of them again, they're just shovelware. Uh, they're games I did not have, and they're all all of the games at this store. They're all do they're a dollar, so. It's a good way to add some games that you're missing to your collection if they're just a dollar. Uh, little list, Bed Shop, France, for the Wii. Jeopardy for the Wii. It's brand new, but the sale is all messed up, so. This one I don't want to show you yet. I probably will. A uh, little switch up right there. You know what? What the hell? Let's open it. Seems like the game is. I thought the game was losing it, but nah. Yeah. Pick it up later. Uh, Guitar Hero Metallica. For the PlayStation 2. I have it for the PlayStation 3 and the Xbox 360, I believe. Let me check. Dreamcast, Madagascar. Not Dreamcast. What am I talking about? DreamWorks, Madagascar. Cards. I do apologize guys, I mean, I'm in and out all the time. My head's still not working great. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm uh, wasting a little bit. And I do apologize. Uh, I think uh, not a lot of oxygen is getting to my brain. Pets Horse, Pets Horse Club. Barbie Horse Avengers. There you go. And this one, Mario Kart for $1. Mario Kart Wii for a dollar complete. And I was gonna pick up the case and I started opening up the order I started opening all of the games. And I saw this one. So I'm glad I found it. So guys, there you go. Always check. You never know what you're gonna find in one of those crappy game cases. I mean this is not the greatest game or it's not a it's not going for a lot. But it's still a good uh get your money back without this one. Like I said, my brain's not working right now. <laughs> Almost there. Almost there. Alright guys, uh, it's gonna be another punch up find or finds. I paid uh, I think well or something for all of this. Can't remember. Probably Go back and look at the video. Like I said, my brain's not working right. Uh, I think I paid 12 something. All of them were 15. I think it was like 15. Castlevania, Lord of Shadows. I already have this one. I already have it, so it's gonna be a reseller. I'll sell it. Make some of my money back. Silent Hill Downpour. And all of these games are in amazing condition. I mean like brand new, not one scratch on them. Maybe a hair on it, but 
not a scratch on it. Uh, Heavenly Sword. It's going to that collection. And this one. This one. And this one. And this one. They're going to be uh, recoupers. I'm going to get my money back with them. And add some of this titles to my collection. Because I already picked uh, one of these games. I think it was last video that I made. Same pawn shop. I know I left one behind when I picked up the other one and uh, I guess somebody came in with another one or something because uh, I found two uh, this past week. They're both in amazing condition. So there you go. That's be it for that. And uh, I'm going to show you this. It's a loose game. Uh, for a PSP of Ghost Rider. It was a gift from uh, my younger brother. I didn't have this one and it was... Um, we, re we really liked the movie when it came out so he gave it to me. Alright guys, and I left, in my opinion, the best for last. So uh, I'm sorry I made you wait. So I know you saw it at the beginning of the video. And I picked up a... Uh, GameCube lot. It was everything GameCube and some uh, uh, Game Boy Advance and Game Boy games. Let's go through the Game Boy games first. Let's go through them first. Uh, Solar Striker for the Game Boy. Super Mario Bros. Deluxe. Super Mario Land. Tetris. Baseball. My favorite, Game Alone, Game, uh, Home Alone. Game Boy NFL Football. Game Boy Advance, it's going to be Metro Metroid Fusion, Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, and there. Metroid Zero Mission, Wolfenstein 3D. Castlevania Area of Sorrow I'm going to tell you guys my heart skip a beat when I start this game uh, I'll follow up a little pouch It's a very good game in my opinion Classic NES series Metroid and um, Namco Museum That's it The case there's two uh, Tingle Bobs, which I have no idea what they are. Yet. There you go. The GameCube. Uh, with the Game Boy player at the bottom. Game inside, but oh my goodness gracious, is this GameCube beautiful? It is practically in mint condition for being the platinum uh, GameCube. I don't see scratches on it, except for uh, maybe a little bit on the jewel case there. But uh, I mean, it's amazing, it's better than mine for sure. So, probably gonna be my go to. Uh, Thank you. And uh, what made this whole thing worth it, and this by far was my favorite find of the week, because I found this. How about them apples? It is the Game Boy Player, the elusive, super rare Game Boy Player with manual in case. 
and a little memory card. So guys, it doesn't really get much more better than this. And I paid, I think, and I came with the case, another beautiful case. And I paid $24.99 for the whole thing. $24.99. Can you believe it, guys? I can't. It came with all the hookups and power cords and whatnots. It did came with a uh, third party controller, which I'm not a very big fan of. That's alright. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven controllers for the GameCube. So I'm not worried about that. I don't really like it, but. Came with the bundle, so I can't complain. Guys, there you have it. That's my pickups for the whole two weeks that I missed. Sorry, and I really apologize for uh, my craziness right now, but uh, I still wanted to make a video. I couldn't go two weeks without making a video for you guys. You know, I really appreciate all your support, and uh, 